That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, gang. Hi, everyone. Thank you. No, no. Welcome back to our travel throwbacks of our California honeymoon. This is the penultimate video. Would you believe it? Am I, am I hurting your knee? No, you're okay. Sorry. It's all right. Um, so this week we headed to Monterey oh, and. Monterey. Yosemite. It was actually Cal's birthday on the first day of this vlog. Was, was it? Oh, yeah, I mean, that was at Pismo, wasn't it? We woke up and Went we to Denny's. over. Did we? It was Denny's for your birthday. Oh, yes, that's the best treat in the world. Did we? Yeah. Because oh. I'm there going, happy birthday to you. Oh, that's the best. Oh, I forgot about that movie. <laughs> <laughs> and then after Denny's, after the birthday treat, we um, did the Pacific Coast Highway Drive. It was a little bit like overcast, wasn't it? It was quite foggy in points yes. but then we'd yeah, hit yeah. like a pocket of like really nice sunshine um but yeah it was just the like the most amazing scenery and we saw like Bix is it bixby bridge and mcquay fall like all the yeah we did all the points along the way it's, like did big or oh, big sir that was where we stopped isn't it we stopped in big sir we did um yeah it was just like a really good experience i think if Next time we go, as much as I say I'd do everything the same again, the only thing I'd do different is we'd probably start at the top and come down because we were on the wrong side of the road. So we had to keep pulling over, didn't we? Whereas if we were on the other side, mm. it would have been the right, like the right side to get It was It was country. such a chill drive as well because you'd kind yeah, of Yeah, we just kind of like made our way up, didn't we? And you we? just stop. So like you could see there was lots of other, obviously other tourists doing the same thing. So kind of just put your... Um, your indicator on you just pulled off to the side and then mm. go and have five minutes look around it was it was pretty cool wasn't it yeah it was really cool and then as we got up towards Monterey we did the there's like a set route that you can do so you pay like it's like in the middle of like a residential place isn't it, it is, but you're yeah. like, there's like a thing and you pay it's called 17 mile drive I'm sure it's 17 mm -hmm. mile drive and then there's like loads of things to stop off and see on the way so there was like that grand cypress tree it was like yeah. the restless seas restless seas that was it yeah so um, it's just like there's just a bit of a cone. yeah there's kind of like bits of and the, it's, it's like points. unsurprisingly where it's the sea's very restless lots yeah. of big waves you and went and cool. that's one of the funniest parts Callum like tries to go in the sea and it's very cold and it's oh yeah do you remember it's, it's, it's really it's cold um so yeah, and then we headed up to Monterey. We stayed in another Hyatt, Hyatt Regency in Monterey. That was a beautiful hotel, mm -hmm. like stunning. On a golf course, wasn't it? it was and it was not, it really wasn't that bad value no. either. No, not at all. Um, Monterey, like in general, was probably one of my favorite places. Yeah, it surprised me because- It was I... very kind of like, like small town, Canada-y kind of like- Yeah, it had like a, like a British, Canadian American feel to it. Yeah. Um, it felt really comfortable and really yeah. like. We, I think we said of all of our California trips, if we were to live somewhere. Yeah. In a, you know. I mean, I'd say in most places on the rocks, we live here, California. Yeah. <laughs> but Montreal. It was really, yeah. really nice. Yeah, it was amazing. Yeah. yeah, it was a bit chilly like the first day, but it, don't let that deceive you because Callum ended up with a burnt face. The burnt of stiff the face. But, <laughs> Um, so we went to the aquarium because you can't go to Montreal without going to the aquarium. That was, like, that was incredible. Cool. Yeah, really good. I just remember there was like a speaker that sounded like, um, what's the face from Fifty First Dates? Oh, Drew Barrymore. Drew Barrymore. I was, <laughs> I was convinced it was Drew Barrymore. She's got nothing better to see on a TV yeah. afternoon than that. <laughs> um, that, yeah, because there's so at the at the aquarium there's like a really big outdoor bit as well, but inside yeah. there's. One of the, like the biggest, biggest tanks glass, you've ever seen. yeah, like tanks you've ever seen. It was, it was really impressive, mm. wasn't it? Yeah. So many species and everything. It was, yeah. Wow, it that was, was really good. And then we went from there to one of the other like ultimate highlights. Yeah. So we, so we went down Canary Row, which is quite famous um, yeah. in Monterey. So we kind of had a walk on the front, which was just lovely. And mm. then yeah, we went down to um, one of the piers, and we went whale watching. And it was one of these places where they guarantee that you will see a whale. It if was, not we used money princess, back. princess whale, what, princess whale watching or something. That sounds about right. It, yeah. Again, like it was only like twenty five dollars each or something ridiculous. Was that was much? another like wedding gift. Yeah. Oh, it was just 
like the footage is shaky because it was quite a rocky day wasn't it yes like it was a windy day and that's where callum burnt his face because it was quite overcast and we it was cold and, but it was really windy we had ju so i think it was just a lot of wind yeah we had jumpers on and everything but it was just the wind just burnt me so much but yeah the footage is a little bit shaky I think um, that's it's made me want to get a gimbal definitely for like whenever <laughs> we whenever we do anything any more vlogs again um but yeah it was like amazing wasn't it we saw mainly humpbacks, humpbacks loads of humpbacks and then we got kind of like a glimpse of a blue whale the kind of last bit of the footage where there's like a whale going down and then it's tail coming up um that's a blue whale so that's like <laughs> like you know when you just think that did we take it in like did we appreciate it enough at the time or is it something now i'm just like oh my god mm. like it was amazing to see a blue whale is bucket list thing isn't it yeah it's, it's it was really incredible well, on a bucket list is to go swimming with it but oh my god <laughs> Optimistic. But yeah, that was that was fantastic, yeah. wasn't it? And then you see a very drunk Sean. Sorry. Oh <laughs> yeah. So we went to Tiki something. Okay. I say it in the vlog. Okay, so this is in the vlog. So we went to like a tiki bar. We had some amazing food. And cocktail. The beers were great. It was um like Sierra Nevada, I think we're drinking. Yeah. And you were drinking lots of cocktails. I think you'd had a couple of cocktails, but she was a drunk. So I drove. Yeah, so I was by that. Um, but it was that that I, I recommend that to everyone. Yeah. That, that place, it was so so good. So um, we uh, left Monterey and then we went over to Yosemite. So that drive was lovely. Oh, the weather was so nice in Yosemite too. Yeah, the weather was incredible. Um, another thing, like I, I feel like we did appreciate Yosemite, but it's another place where I'm like, oh god, I need to go back and absorb it all more. we saw we, we did see some amazing and I, mm. I feel like we had a really good experience there we took our time with it and things yeah. we didn't rush anything so we we just explored didn't we yeah so we were on the thing on the first day we went to a place called hetch hetchy yeah that so, was near our lodge which that's was, it. Wasn't it yeah so obviously Something it's just down. all mountains there so to try and travel a mile yeah might take 50 it's an exaggeration but 30 to get down to the floor so we ended up going to see hetch hetchy which was a man-made dam, which... Um, it was we were the only it, people there as well, weren't we? Yeah, that was... Yeah, it was The scale of it was unbelievable, wasn't it? Yeah. And some amazing views. Um, and then... We stayed in a place called Evergreen Lodge, which is literally just outside the boundary of the National Park. Um, but, that, like, amazing. Yeah. It's, like, amazing. Although there's, like, signs about bears. I mean, I remember I was so paranoid. So because scared. we had, like, food and stuff in, the, in with us. You have to, like, double... <laughs> double box your food and then put it in like a safe box thing and I was just like so scared that a bear was going to come into our cabin. She was worried that the bear would want cereal bars <laughs> or, or bags of Haribo because that's all we had. <laughs> so she ended up, <laughs> it was so funny. And we wouldn't go on that walk, remember there was like a walk and I didn't dare do it because there was a risk of bears. Mm. In retrospect I should have just done it. But we did get to see the sunset didn't we? The sunsets were amazing yeah. Um... And then the next day we did Yosemite Falls. We yeah, saw we went, Half we Dome, and then we did this like drive. So we yeah we drove up to Glacier Point, which um, I have a real irrational fear of being twenty feet On a within a yeah mountainside. It's got a windy weird... roads. It wasn't yeah. scary. I don't think it was scary. No, that bit was okay. It was it was very high, but I, the roads there tested me a lot because they just it's just drops like it's just sheer <laughs> drops. <laughs> Um, but yeah, Glacier Point, like if you're going to Yosemite, it's well worth the drive, like well sure. worth the trip, like the views were just incredible. Yeah. Um, and I think that we just had like pool time and stuff after that, didn't we? We did, we went to an all-you-can-eat barbecue. Yeah. Which um, was hosted at the hotel. It was just... It was amazing. Just, just one of the best moments for me as well, we just like, we, we were sat out on the porch and there was a game of Uno. And we just played in there oh, for yeah. a little bit. <laughs> With that hammock out the front, there's like hammocks that you could just chill in. It was it was yeah. really, really great. Um just the the scale of Yosemite, you cannot fathom it. You just can't get your head around yeah. how big that place is. We we loved it. I feel like I took that in quite a lot, yeah. Yosemite. Um I think we probably do more like trails and stuff now, like probably mm. more into walking and stuff now. But Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. And then that's it. That was all that we did and then from Yosemite, we're headed to Napa, which is what we will do next vlog. Exciting, nice, isn't it?
isn't it? Looking back at it. Really exciting. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to Callum. Happy birthday to you. We've come to his favourite place for his breakfast. Dennis. Dennis. This is my blueberry pancakes and a fried breakfast. You get both here. Are you happy, Callum? Very happy. I'll be happy when I put the bacon in. Oh, that's pretty then. This is Pismo Beach. Take the Pismo Beach. That's not the same. This is Pismo... So... <laughs> this is Pismo Beach. And that's now a mountainside. So this is a... Uh, the Pacific Coast. Callum's taken over driving. So that I can take photos. But um, the lighting is a bit... A bit rubbish at the moment. Um, we're hoping to stop off in a minute and see some seals. Um, but it's a beautiful drive, it's just a shame we can't get some amazing photos really. Scaredy cat. Hi. What's wrong? Heights. And your driving is erratic. I don't know if you've got the traffic. It's very misty, but just beautiful. Driving on the Pacific Coast Highway. What? Several hours of driving. Hi. Hey, there it is. Midway Falls. And I wish I was sunbathing if there was sun down there. It's very awesome. Kind of like the cave having a wee. Yeah, it's beautiful it's around here. Blue down there. Clear, clear, blue. Good. The sun is out, yay! The landscape has changed quite a lot. We're now in the mountains. It reminds me a lot of Canada. And we've stopped at this little um, inn. We're going to get a bit to eat. It's beautiful. Our bad boy car is doing very well. There's the birthday boy. Isn't it? Ah, it's very good. So, yeah, we're gonna go get something to eat. Hi. Hi. We're just That's sitting awesome. in the sun. And um, with big flower behind us. It's beautiful, isn't it, Dan? Burrito. Burrito. Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> I just had to do a quick film of this because it's just stunning. It's 
This is a 17 mile drive, we've just seen the lone cyclist. We are now driving to our next point of interest. It's very nice around here, but we're going to live here and then Callum can play lots of golf as we are um, in oh, Pebble so Beach. I'm not wearing seatbelts. Very nice. Fair. Oh, I'm single. <laughs> Sunny Montre. Okay. There's Sean, enjoying the sun. Got sunny's Hello. on. Got a nice dark coat there. It's pretty cool. Funky dark coat. Funky. Dark coat. Funky. Okay. Yeah, it's pretty cool around here. There's a little bridges. Awesome. Anyway, we're just walking to well watching.
tiki roomy mom to me. It's very cool. Well, it's a bit dark. Callum's drinking beer. I have got a cocktail as per usual. You had a nice day, Callum. Pizza. Huh? Good. Really, really, really good. Did you like the whales? Saw so whales. Saw so them back. Saw so a little bit of a blue whale as well. Which is good. Um, Wait, um, went to an aquarium. Um, got burnt. On yeah, face. Pan's got burnt face. You can't see because it's dark. Um, this place is very cool indeed. Awesome. So looking forward to my dinners. It's very dark, so I'm going to go. Love you, bye. Hi, Fran. Hiya. How are you? I'm good. Oh dear, two cocktails. <laughs> oh my god, it was so good. So good. How's your belly? Very good. <laughs> Mine is massively full. But it was amazing. Really good food. Um, so yeah. yeah. Gonna go back to the um, hotel and maybe have a drink. Maybe I'll get to have a little drink, which will be nice, rather than this one drinking it all. All right, I love you, bye. I'll be the one who took you in at night, and if you want to leave, I can guarantee you won't find nobody else like me. But you don't look ashamed, and baby, I'm not I can't scared. Remember the words from 2000. Follow me, everything is alright. I'll be the one to took you in at night, and if you want to leave. This is the uh, San Luis Reservoir. Sorry. It's beautiful. We're on the way to Yosemite from... Where are we Montreux. coming from? Montreux. Montreux. <laughs> <laughs> I'm losing track. Um, it's a very nice drive so far. We don't really know where we're going, but... That's, that's good, though. We'll get there, I'm sure. Morning. Morning. Okay. Very good to you. How's your burnt face? Yeah, burnt, thanks. Really burnt. Really tight and burnt. Oh dear. Or a ski mask, a balaclava in the 70s. Yeah. It's cold. Yeah, looking forward to uh, the continuing views. Good afternoon. We're in afternoon now. There's a bit of temperature. Hey, we've gone warm again. We're like 30 degrees more than Monterey. Maybe even more than that. About 40 degrees more. Crazy. So yeah, so we're just going around some pretty cool roads again. Just want to show you what we're doing. Really. Mm. Got anything to chip in with Sean? No? She's shaking her head. It's fun. It's fun. She's enjoying it. She's enjoying a little, little drive. She's driving again. She'd forgotten what it was like driving, but she's driving again. She's recovered from the gin last night, so she's, uh, she's driving again. <laughs> there she is. <laughs> Drunk. Too many cocktails, too much gin. No, not too many cocktails. Too many strong cocktails. Oh. It's nice. Very good. There's some more water down there as well. So this is Hetch Hetchy in Yosemite, it is probably one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen. Other than me. Other than me. Other than Callum, obviously. Boom. Just amazing. This is Evergreen Lodge, our lodgings for Yosemite, for the picnic area. 
Lots of firewood there. Scott would go crazy over that firewood. You got the keys? Put them in the bag, didn't you? And these are the cabins. This is cabin. Hi, mate. Did you have fun at Hetchetchi? Yeah, good, yeah. Amazing, wasn't really it? Really good. So, oh, these are, it's like forest holidays, but in Yosemite. Very cool. <laughs> and then this is our little area. So, we can picnic bench if we fancy it. Hammock, which I've already uh, got quite comfortable with. And this is our little house. We have our cool uh, rocking chairs out front. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's uh, amazing. Say hello, Callum. Hello, Callum. Are you going to narrate? Um, yeah, I'm on my second steak. Second hot dog. This is a, an all you can eat barbecue going on by the pool as the sun's going down in Yosemite. Pretty cool. <laughs> Nice beer, nice steak and salad. Charles mini version, yeah. baby version of this one. There's a nice fire pit uh, going on over there. Have some s'mores in a little bit. Very cool indeed. So, we're in Yosemite Valley now, well, just above it, but it's pretty special. Not quite sure what anything is yet, but that's some big rocks. That's Sean. Morning. Morning. How are you? Mm. How's your granola? Mm, Very good. Very good. This is the beautiful Yosemite. It's amazing. We just sat on a big fallen down tree trunk. Hi Callum. Hi me. It's beautiful. This is the Half Dome, the world famous. If you want to climb that, it takes 10 to 12 hours and is extremely strenuous, so apologies Johnny. This is for you, but we're not going to do it. But I know one day you will. So, it's pretty high. Yeah, a little bit. Amazing falls. And where's the amazing wife? There <laughs> she is. Definitely worth the drive. So yeah, there we go. Thank you very much for watching this week's vlog. Make sure you check back next week for Napa Valley and San Francisco. Um, the last one. Last one of the road trip. Sad times. It's been like good throwbacks though. It's been good great. throwbacks. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. Do you want to do your bit? Like, subscribe, comment below. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.